All right. What I want to do is, since I'm starting to see a lot of people talk about this reflection, and I've been seeing this since the beginning of the case, a lot of people said this was an extra door here, which we find out that's that's the window. There's not, nothing else on the other side. Now they're saying that uh, that's somebody sitting next to Ty. Okay. They're trying to say, at first they were saying, you know, it's the janitor. Then they were saying, you know, it was probably one of the security guards. You know what I'm saying? It was important at the beginning because we needed to see that. All right. We needed to sort of like eliminate whatever is false right and bring out the evidence of whatever is real right so that was needed at that time but now since so much of the truth is out we need to dismantle all of the little distractions that's still lingering okay because this is an important time for the distractions now because at the beginning the distractions were, you know, important at the time, but at the same time, it, it it wasn't. It was too much noise for the distractions to be fully effective as it would be now. You see what I'm saying? Because a lot of people are aggravated at the fact that this case is not being taken serious by authority. So, and it's been so long, right? I mean, not long enough to say that it's been so long, but you know, in this day and age, a lot of people they just so. You know, everything is instant and quick. You know what I'm saying? They don't like to take their time with a lot of things. But um, uh, for those who do, we tend to get stuck at, at, at you know, some point where, you know, is, is, is this true or is this not? Now that we know it is, it is not true, what authority is going to do about what is true? And then here comes the distractions. You see what I'm saying? And that gets aggravating. You feel me? So we have to dismantle the distractions at this point. Because the distractions can speak loud now. It's not enough noise to drown out the distractions now. You see what I'm saying? And I'm pretty sure since I'm saying this now, you're going to get a lot more distractions. Because they are watching, they are listening. And I'm watching and I'm listening too. So we can keep going at this. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm not going to keep going in circles, which is the reason why you haven't been seeing too many videos from me since my last video. But I'm still watching. I'm watching for important things that I can bring out. And this is one of those things, right? So let's get to the point. What are we looking at when we look at this reflection? Is this somebody standing there to tie? Is this a security guard? Is this a, a janitor? Is this, You see what I'm saying? Um... I don't want to say no. I don't want to say yes. I don't want to say no. What I want to do is show you, right? So what we're going to do is, I'm going to play the video. You know, I don't like do still shots. All right? And if you look in this area, you'll see. See that little tag, little hat right here? You see what I'm saying? Like, now, what I want to show people is the fact that this area, okay, this area is a reflection of you see that lamp right there that lamp is sitting in between the beds all right if you remember irene's life that lamp that was sitting in between the beds at the the headboards of the beds the headboard area okay that wall that's along the headboard area of the beds there's a, a lamp sitting in between the beds ty is standing at the foot of the beds all right he's standing at the wall in front of the foot of the beds okay so this area can't be shown two areas at the same time it can only be shown one area okay so this area is showing the headboard area of the beds this lamp is between those beds okay so with that being said this person clearly cannot be standing there to tie this person has to be somewhere by the beds. This person is sitting down. Okay? So if we go further, we'll see who this person is. Remember the beds, right? Remember the beds. It's this person. This is who you see.
starting to see that little glare at the top. That this is who you see. Okay. Now, what I want to do is, I want to go frame by frame. Okay. I want to go frame by frame. So I'm gonna use this program that I usually use. It's one of my little secrets, but I let the secret out just for you. It's a free program. You can you can utilize it however you want. Just don't bring in the foolishness into the game. All right. Just don't bring in the foolishness into this case with this. This case this can be used powerfully, you know, respectfully for positive or negative. You understand what I'm saying? So choose wisely, because in the words of 54 keys, I'm on your ass. All right. Now, as you can see, this person is here. Okay, you see the so-called name tag, you see the the hat, the so-called hat or whatever. And I could probably show you this person also in the um in the lobby. I gotta check and see. If not, you 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 won't see it in this video, but I'll check and see. But anyway, can you see that? This is who you're looking at in that reflection. I'm going frame by frame so you can't miss it. Okay? That's who you was looking at in the reflection. Let's go back. Again, you could not have been looking at anybody standing next to Ty. Okay? Again, here's that 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 lamp. This person is in front of that lamp in the bed area they're in front of that lamp in the bed area who else is there in front of that lamp in the bed area along the line of that reflection it's this person that person been sitting in your face the whole time the whole time they've been saying that's a security guard the whole time they've been saying that maybe a janitor that person has been sitting in your face the whole time See how lies spread? And I'm going backwards with it. Okay? Just going forward and backwards. So you can, I mean, I could put a little more forensics on here, but I'm the type of person I like for common sense to outdo forensics. You see what I'm saying? Because when we get to talking about forensics, now we're talking about you know alterations in order to bring out ever you know in order to you know bring out further details and why go through the alterations when you got common sense by your side common sense is by your side now I can brighten it up a little bit let's try that Turn his own. And put some bite light on it. Alright. Again, let's go frame by frame. That's the person you're seeing in that reflection. See if we can get some sharp on it. Let's stabilize it a little bit. I don't want to put too much on it. And um, 
Yeah, let's get some sharp on it. Well, let's see about a good. Uh, I don't want it to be too much. That should be enough right now. Alright, let me see on. Um, that was the sharpening and strong coloration. Maybe a little bit of contrast. Just a tad bit. I don't want to bother with the equalizer. I don't want to bother with the noise. Alright, let's see what we can do from him. Alright. Now that black that black lining that that's the um let me point it out to you so that's the stabilizer see that it's to um sort of keep the 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 picture or the image in the video sort of stable to where normally it would be shaky or you know what I mean. Can you see this clearly now? I mean, not clear as if we're standing right there in the room with these people, but clear as far as that reflection. This person is clearly sitting down. The lamp is there, okay? This person is in front okay they're in a reflection so they're in front of this lamp and they're sitting down on the bed this lamp is on the other side of that bed behind the person okay the lamp is on the other side of that bed behind the person well there's the person standing sitting right there they've been sitting there the whole time all right So let's be done with this lie. All right, let's get it over with. There's no security guard right there. There's no damn um janitor. You know what I'm saying? Some people want to make it out to be the you know the, the, the dude, the young dude that was talking to the female. You know, in the um in one video that this girl made. You know, when he you know claimed that he know this and know that, but. He wasn't really saying too much of shit. There you go. Alright. So let's let's be done with that lie. And let's get back to business, alright?